So so, uh, I talked about judgment earlier, and there's another kind um, of judgment. When you are in a room and someone is being judged negatively or harshly, um, and you might feel that you need to defend them, or you might be asked to defend them. And uh, it's my feeling, and I might be wrong, but this is how I have always handled it, that to defend somebody, especially a friend of mine, that... uh, Say, I'm probably the reason why it pops up while they're not present, and I am, is uh, as a friend of them, my, uh, that person's a friend of mine. I might give these people who don't really even seem to care that much about, you know, say my friend, more information about that person's life than they would have. I mean, the whole reason they're like negatively judging this person, why they're not there, because uh, it sounds like they don't understand why they behave a certain way or why they do the things they do for fun or. Um, it's probably they want to get that information. So they're almost kind of goading or tricking you into giving away private information uh, or private insight that you would get from uh, being a friend. Like, you know, you'd sit down with that guy over a beer or uh, out, uh, out here along the water, and he'd turn to you and say, you know, I really enjoy this thing. I know a lot of people don't understand it, but I want you, I want you to, 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 to listen to why uh, I do it. And... Uh, you know, I hope you I hope you understand once I explain. And then they you know they kind of open up their uh, their heart, mind, and soul to you, and uh, especially a man telling you uh, what they love um, is telling you a lot about their most private workings, uh, what goes on inside their head. And uh, you know, not a lot of people, uh, myself included, want other people to know that kind of thing. You know, despite, uh, for instance, for me, like despite being a pretty open person, um, I still also try to keep a certain level of uh, of uh, almost privacy uh, uh, going on in my life. So let's let this plane go by. So yeah, I'd say don't defend your friend. Um, your friend uh, doesn't need defending from people who are being judgmental. Um, I think that your friend uh, necessarily wouldn't maybe even appreciate it being defended. I think that uh, you could just tell those people uh, you've got nothing to add and uh, leave it at that. You know, if they really want to understand, you know, when they're judging somebody, if they really want to understand that person, they'll go talk to that person. You know, so the fact that they've done it by talking about, uh, going to talk to you about them to get your take on the matter. Hey, Keila. I don't know, it's just like a, a coward's way to explore the personalities of others. Yeah, so I don't, uh, I don't take part in it. I don't, uh, I don't answer people's questions like that, and uh, I try not to speculate, especially in a negative way, about what's going on for someone else, especially about something they enjoy, about some, uh, some things that they hold uh, uh, maybe sacred or uh, at least very important to them. All right, there you go. Judgment.